guys, my name is Maria. I go to Rhodes College and I'm from Orlando, Florida, and I'm on the comparative health program. Right now I'm walking to class with my friend and I'm super excited to bring you guys along for a day in the life of Florence. So we made it to class and we're learning about the Mediterranean diet today with Professor Singh. Hi guys, so we just got out of class and we've been walking around shopping and now we're gonna go find lunch. Yay! We decided to try Italian McDonald's and we'll see how it goes. My favorite part of the trip has been meeting all these amazing people and seeing amazing places. Um, I've gotten to know some really amazing girls, especially my lovely roommate. My favorite destination so far has been Florence. I just really like how walkable it is and everyone's so nice. And we're just really centrally located, which makes it really easy to get around. And yeah, it's really pretty. I think my favorite part about Florence has been the food. It's just so good, eating like fresh pasta. And the weather has also been super, super nice. And in Spain, it was a little bit rainy. And in London, it was a little cold. So it's just nice to be back in the sun again. I'm on a comparative health program. So we're comparing the three different healthcare systems of the three different stops that we make. And so we did a week in London and then a week in Barcelona and this is our last week and it's in Florence. And so basically we learn about all these health systems and we get to go on a few like field trips. And so we went to like some different hospitals. We did a medical history walking tour. Oh, we went to a med school and like different health hubs in different cities. And yeah, it's been really, really cool and really, really fun. Like with the in-classroom component and then the out-of-classroom component. So I chose the study abroad program for a few reasons. My main reason was because I'm a minor in health equity and I was able to like combine my interest in global health with health equity um, through this class. And then my other reason for choosing this class is because of the three destinations. I really wanted to see as much as I could in as short amount of time as I could. And it's been really great like spending a week in each place Managing school and traveling while abroad has definitely been hard, especially because we've been going to such big cities where there's so much to see. But um, we've definitely been able to do it by like staying up late, getting up early, using every little free time that we have, and yeah, just making the most of all of our time. Yes, so part of our um, like tuition, I guess, is the flights. So um, AIFS books our flights for us, and they also handle all the transportation, like from where we're staying and to the airport and from the airport to where the next place, which is super, super nice just because it's nice to be in a group and not have to like worry about things, especially when going international and yeah. I actually didn't know anyone before I got to this trip and I was really nervous about making friends, but I had great success. And now here we are. And it's been really cool to be able to get to know people from other schools and other parts of the US. And I know I'll cherish their friendship forever. I thought it was pretty easy booking with APHIS. I didn't think it was too complicated. Um, the application on the website was really simple and I guess the person who's in charge of your re region they like have office hours and like you can schedule phone calls with them and so that was really nice and helpful to like get all my questions answered and everyone's super accessible like via email or phone call. Our class schedule we have class once a day and we normally have like an activity scheduled as well. Um, class sometimes is in the morning or the afternoon and it's about like three hours and then our activity is just a few hours as well and it normally correlates to what we did in class that day. We also get two free days, um, our travel day after our flight. We have the rest of the day free to like rest up, get acclimated and stuff like that. And then we have a full free day to do whatever we want and explore the cities that we're in. And then we also like during the like school week we get um, like a break for lunch. And like we normally have time to like do our schoolwork and like go out and explore and like do all the things that we want to do. So I think I think the schedule is set up really well. I think the most important thing to remember is that everyone's trying to make friends here. A lot of people come on these programs alone. And so just be open to making new connections and talking to people and getting out of your comfort zone. And like lean on the people around you, like your roommate. I was really lucky and I got a lovely roommate. 
I think it really depends on what you're looking for in a program. If you want to immerse yourself in one place, then I definitely would suggest doing a single destination. I really wanted to just see as much as I could see, so that's why I picked a multi-destination one. And it really worked out because I was able to use our free days and like I went to other cities and the countries that we were staying in. And so it was really cool, but it did feel a little bit rushed just because we only have seven days in each city. So it just depends on what you're looking for but I think both are really great opportunities. I know people who have done single destination placements and they loved it. Today we are making pasta and I'm so excited to <laughs> learn about the Mediterranean diet some more. Yay! Yay! We're all so hard at work, yay! Every time that we have class, we have like some sort of activity or something. Um, today it was a cooking class. Um, yesterday we spoke with a doctor here in Florence. And we've also visited a med school and different hospitals. And just had a lot of really interesting conversations about the healthcare systems in all these different countries. There's learning going on in and outside of the classroom, which makes this whole experience super interesting and well-rounded. Yeah. Yes, so I'm a chemistry major and I'm also on the pre-med track, so I'm just taking a lot of sciences um, every semester. And I could have maybe gone a whole semester if I had been a little bit more organized, but that's not how it worked out. And I'm really excited to be here for the summer.